is going on, people? Welcome back. Johnny here. And we are playing some RimWorld. I need to do some research into additional recreation. We're working on apparel. Repair those since we have a lot of tattered apparel. Anyways, this is the Rimhammer the End Times Dwarf mod. The release of the Skaven has created much hubbub. Why is this not getting built? I don't know. Well, anyway. I did some playing just to get some stuff done when I wasn't recording. Maybe about half an hour's worth. And you can see there's not a lot different here. <laughs> so, Sedgie's off to bed. We can do a transport now. She gets so many magic points. She'll max these out. We could probably get some additional spells with her at some point. Where isn't going to be around for much longer. We need proper weaponry as well. We're still kind of struggling in that regard. But anyways, we had some mad monkeys. and uh, We did have a... Where is it at? Mornfang self-tame. <laughs> I'm a little worried it's going to wake up and open my door here. I left it. Oh, you know what? I think I created a zone for it out here, so it wouldn't be that. Let's double check. I did. <laughs> okay. Preparation is the key to success, people. And uh, the goats have been keeping us in meat. We've also harvested bear berries off the map. A fair bit of raw fungus. And we're getting stuff done. These projects are always so massive. It always feels like it goes so stinking slow. Plus a lot of these rooms are just temporary placements for these various items. So there's an eclipse, which makes no difference to us. I was hoping we get raided. Oh, shit balls. Why is that guy fighting? I don't overly care about the Mornfang. Is he going to eat it or was he just, it attacked him? I don't, why did one of them attack him and none of the others? He's fucking kicking their ass. He might take them all out himself. <laughs> so, well, that's good. Alright, let's slow down. Or ignore slow speed. We should have somebody researching. We do not. That's because this dude is up this hauling. No, cutting wood. That's important business. I think we're going to get rid of these just for the sake of it. All wood on the map is being hauled in. It is... Pushing the end of summer here. We have tons of food. So we need more pawns. That's the bottom line. And I've been considering some options for that. We could get out and attack the outcasts. We could wait for the outcasts to attack us. I am tempted to do some mining through here and see if we can't open this up. So if we did like... Oh, there's going to start here. It's going to be a mighty undertaking, but I think it's a good idea. It was in the comments a while ago. It also solves some problems with the animals. Somewhere over here we know we have open space. Now the downside is, look how much walking that's going to be. That's going to be bananas. But we do have a dude who loves mining and will stay on top of mining around the clock. This thing's... Gotten into it with more than a few monkeys. How many monkeys are left? 22. I really don't want anything to do with that. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> Senji's making blocks, which means all the smelting jobs are done. We're gathering a shit ton of resources. Kelvin is our miner, but he's also set the hall at high priority. So that's one of the few things he still does yet. I don't know what he's going to do next. So one thing we can start doing is popping in glowstone lights. We have small glowstones. This brazier is warming things up nicely. We might pop a few more of those around until we can get some magic heaters. And I'm cooking something up for this. I just finished adding the new raid types. And now, ooh, this thing's not going to survive if we don't go help it out, I bet. Just randomly going around attacking monkeys. Anyway, I'm not worried about it. It's just self-tamed. If it dies, we'll butcher it. That's fine. 
It's an ogre beast. I wouldn't mind, in all honesty, if we got an ogre as an ally. A mercenary. Dwarves would use ogre mercenaries. And I think that'd be pretty awesome. I'm going to start walling this stuff up here too. So, boredom seems to have gone away. That's nice. The donkeys are reproducing now. <laughs> I was going to build a barn out here. I started prepping for that. Somewhere to keep the animals. It might make sense to grow hay grass if we're going to keep them permanently. It's been alright because even though growing plants has been a lot of work and dealing with these animals has been a lot of work, they've also kept us in meat and therefore fine meals. Shove off, monkey boys. There's ten left, so... And now the Mornfang's not going to make it. I, I don't think I care. <laughs> it's not a pack animal, I don't think. Plus we have to feed the damn thing if we take it, and that's going to be... It is not a pack animal. That's going to be a lot of work. Clearly the ogre animals started showing up. <laughs> Alright, we're making blocks. Do we have any rituals? Might be worthwhile to make a proper ritual room. Just to, I was thinking about divvying this up a few different ways. If we have a big eating hall, we could have a big ritual room. I don't know. What's uh, Kelvin? He's asleep. I think we'll just chill until the monkeys go away. Alright, there's five monkeys left. I think we're gonna go for it. They're fucking fast, little bastards. Someone's gonna get hurt here. We only have six people. Our other guy. So if we pop out over here, it's not gonna go well. We're gonna get hurt. We want the store held open. I don't think we do. I don't think we want to deal with these animals. We don't have run and gun active. Alright, you wallop. Good job, friend. You. Bewilder Pendulum. Good job, friend. Go hide behind your bros. <laughs> go, go. You lot. Here comes two of them. Alright, any more? Fucking hell, now we have a mad muffalo. Seji. Gleaming arrow. Is this the mad one? It is. Seji. Gleaming arrow. That. Where? Bewilder and feebling foe. Alright, well that did a number on it. Come on. Pow. Finish off. And I want this guy to go back to unrestricted. And we'll have Seji. Just going to tend it. That's fine. You lot are free to go. You deal with this. Any non-rotten monkeys. I think they all rotted. Jesus. Well, I guess we'll take that guy. At least when they just randomly go mad, they don't get scary. Uh, oh, there's one. Uh, Sedge. Oh, you're getting meds. We do have a lot of meds now. I'm going to do that until Sedgy goes away. <laughs> all right, there we go. Mad Muffalo. I could rescue it too once she's done tending it. It'll pull through. Might have some permanent injuries. Let's let's get on to taming that thing though. We finally have an animal that it's gonna eat a shit ton of meat. I probably don't want it inside. I should probably make an animal zone for outside. Ah, we have to walk through these carcasses every time we want to go over there and mine. That's fantastic. Alright. She's bringing that guy in. Alright, good. Meat's rotting away, but I can just get a few other here. And what are you doing? Tending to and stoking the fire. Watch this. Boom, look at that. <laughs> All right, that's no bueno. Everybody to arms. That's part of the reason I did a bunch of mining in the back. Uh, hopefully we've had time to get our magical points back. Alright, you're in the front. You're in the back. You can go in the back. We better get our other bros over here any minute now. You go there. I need this guy with the bow to be over here too. He should re lean around a corner. Alright, can we see the fuckers? Alright, so Sedge... 
That's a mighty range. Well, we hit it, but it didn't seem to give a shit. <laughs> Where? Uh, pendulum? Anybody gonna come over here? Yeah, you are. He's gonna step out of range again. He's gonna waste my spell. Let's lure his ass in. Here they come. Go there. Slow it down. How many big boys do we have? They will come around behind us. That's going to be a bit of a problem. Uh, we don't have a good way to be shooting these dicks right now either. That's a major problem. We only have one guy shooting. How do we fix that? We don't. I guess we put our shooters in these corners. Not rest hug. He needs to stay there. Well, I guess when they get closer, we'll start shooting them. We need to see if we can magic them. Enfeebling foe. I'd rather enfeeble the further away ones. Cast success. This one is still very strong. Are you guys ever going to shoot it? Yes, you are. Good. Well, that didn't last long. This one will enfeeble, as you can see. Here they come from the side. Oh, shit balls. And from below. We're in a bad spot here. Harold, get ready for it. <laughs> Seji, uh, what can you do? Gleaming arrow. Harold, you're gonna have to fight the little one. So I was doing. Oh, he fucking ignored us. That's fine with me. Gleaming arrow. Rest hug is getting his ass kicked. Rest hug is down. How is he doing? Death in seven hours. Alright, those ones are dealt with. We need to go find the other ones. They're all over the goddamn place. We need to get this dude rescued, too. I guess we go down here. They're smashing our fucking tables, these dicks. They're eating my meals. Or no, they're... Wow, you guys blow ass. Just let him in. That's cool. Alright, where did Ware end up? He's down as well. God damn it. I think we still have one over there. That was a death cry, never mind. Alright, here we go. Don't give them the ability to attack you with multiple people. Set you to the back. God, you guys cannot attack for shit. I think everything is getting smashed to shit. Fucking dicks. Get back in here. There it comes. Kelvin, you're up. Here it comes. Nice work, buddy. Nice work. Oh, there's one way over there. That was a crit. We critted it. <laughs> Why are the infestations so powerful? I'm not going to rebuild that fireplace. Uh, I can't really take Kelvin back there at this point. They're just going to have to figure it out with the shooting. We lost our nice room. We're going to lose this dude is the problem. After everything we went through for him. I think we have a Wand of Resurrection somewhere. I'm gonna have Seji rescue him. It is what it is. We have to we have to do something here. There's still too many of them to just charge in balls out. <laughs> Are there any others anywhere if we zoom out? I don't think so. They get like a weird green color. Kelvin, where the fucker's in? Not working. We need to be able to just fight one at a time if we're gonna have any hope here. Here they come. That, oh, he walloped it for seven points a day. <laughs> it's fucking totally <clears> Oh, <throat> well, they lost everything in there. It's fine though. That stuff's easily replaced. Kelvin is his face owned. Where has how long? Seven hours as well. Where is Seji carrying that dude over? If this guy comes around, we're in trouble. Right, we'll get we have no magic over here. We have no abilities. We're literally just... Oh my god. <laughs> they just had to smash every last thing in there. The D-bags. How many jade at this point? How much does this take to 70? It's like two jade short. I want you dudes just to focus on the big guy. Nice work. Double hit. One was a crit. And it missed me. Keep it up. Keep it up. Alright, we got it. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Don't. Is that the last one? I think that's the last one. Sedge, Sedge. Okay, good. She's bringing this guy back. Four hours. Good thing we got over there when we did. 
All right, they're down. You aren't moving too quick. You're good. So you try and rescue where? Oh, fuck me. The big one got up. Not for long, you didn't. You don't consume. Finish off. Are you going to croak? You're all right. So you go get tended. We're going to have to make a proper hospital. There's just not much way around that right now. We need more medical beds as well. All right, you have to deal with these before they start reproducing. Ignore and make it quick. God, everything got blown to shit. That's... I don't think he's a very good shot. And this doesn't count for anything. What if we just did this? That was alright. <laughs> Seems to be a lot faster. I think we might lose wear here, but the humans were always going to be expendable, so that's where it's at. I need to make sure everybody's getting tended as well before someone croaks. Again, we have a wand of resurrection, so it's not the end of the world. The Skaven will be infesting momentarily. I'm going to allow all this. Where are you, Seji? All right, Kelvin. This dude's fine. Everybody else is... Oh, everybody's going to pull through. Fuck. Now we have an infection on wrist tug. Seji. Build a copy of this over here. Make it medical. Seji rescued. Did these guys get fully tended? Yes. No. Seji, you got to do this for me. Where did my other bro go? This is really spilling over. Clearly this strategy sucks. Uh, Harold, that's our guy. You. No. No, that's not what you're going to do. Unless you're very low on food. I need somebody to get up and clean. Before we get more infections. Uh, he's not getting up. He can do it. Ten that guy. Well, good thing we had a ton of meds because we desperately needed them. What the hell is that? That is the demise of a delicious gazelle. That's what that was. <laughs> okay, well that sucked. There's our Morn Fang. I need to make a zone to keep that thing outside. So I'm going to do area one. We're going to clear it. I don't want it coming in, eating the meat, and doing that kind of shit, so. So I think we'll just, can I copy a zone, I wonder? And then, all right, so then we should just be able to go to manage, area one, invert, rename. This will be for smart animals. This guy gets back to area one. No, smart animals. <laughs> all right, well, we took some punishment there. Said he's untended yet. You have to be shitting me. <laughs> Is anybody around? No. Are you good at medicine? You are. Are you in decent enough health to tend? There. Not going to be the best, but there it is. Good thing we're growing meds, because we're going to need them. Why don't you? I wish you could control, oh, control the animal and get them to attack. Like this dude, big beast, get him to attack this little turtle over here. There's another infection. If it's where, we're in big trouble. It's Kelvin. Fuck. Jesus Christ. <laughs> well, <laughs> we have to get everybody tended to rest tag. Were you just infected then? No. All right, Kelvin was infected. Sedge, I need your help. Well, we have some bad infections, but I think we're okay. This guy might have to bed rest. He's not doing well, and this guy might not make it at all. No. Uh, well, now Rorik might not make it as well. All right, so Rorik and Ware are gonna bed rest. I think that's going to be the best way to try and get them to pull through. Rorik, where? Seji, what's wrong with this dude? He's on a tantrum. 
He's gonna smash what? Things in his room. I need, I need to get that fixed. Where's his room? We're just gonna go cast that spell on him and then get him to bed rest. All right, so transmutation of the unstable mind. Get a little closer so it doesn't possibly fail. Off you go. You're supposed to bed rest, friend. Consuming a fucking fine meal. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, I think, I think a proper hospital is in order with clean floors. I think if if it's this is teaching me anything, that's one of the things. If somebody shows up to raid us while this dude's out here, he's in big fucking trouble. Don't know how best to deal with that. Maybe we make a tunnel that like runs through here and comes up, say so as a sort of a back way out if people show up. But if he's way over here mining. And they show up. He's just fracked. I don't know if that's going to be such a good idea. I'm going to cancel that. I can't really have him out there until he's properly attired. And we can support him. Rorik. Health. Mm, yeah, Rorik's not doing great. <laughs> Needs. Not good. Keldon's doing just fine. Rorik. Oh, well that's good. Considering the moods around here lately, I think we're going to lose the human. I don't think he's going to pull through outside of us coming up with some shit. Rorik, you're so Oh, you're going to eat that shit, huh? <laughs> Tending to wear. Does it even bother or worthwhile to tend? It'd be helpful if we had put some light in here, probably. Mm, I mean, it looks like he's slowly getting ahead of it, but... Well, we're staying on top of the tending, 43%. And the place is a mess. If he does croak, we can bring him back to life. So, I don't know that he's the best pawn for that, but... Idiot. See, he's creeping on it. It just has to hit... 100% immunity before the infection hits 101%. Still making meals, no one's building. Yeah, he barely pulled that out. <laughs> Fuck me. And I don't think this guy's gonna... No, look, he did! I can't believe it. I expected the human to die from that. And this is why... It's why you don't even bother making plants in RimWorld. Because that event just pops up on its own little schedule, and there you go. <laughs> like, it's just gonna happen once in a while, and there's not a lot you can do for it. Unless you have a life mage, you can cure it. Alright, dirt burners break out. Dirt burner looks like a human. I'm just gonna ignore. Uh, hey, where's Beck? Capable of walking. Oh my god, did. I don't know about permanent injuries, but I don't see any. Any new ones, anyway. <laughs> These guys were missing toes before. He's good. He had an infection that he got over. I can't believe this guy pulled through. I thought for sure where was toast. Alright, I guess these insects can be dealt with now. And all this shit. I feel like we're just getting it together, and it's not going to be long before it falls back apart. I also want one of these in here. There we go. Well, cheers to the patrons. Adam C., Shroud, Benjamin D., Thomas K., Carrie Mahoney, Corno Boater, Dimitri Rurikid, Genghis Keith, Ginger Vitus, Groove Lord, Gunnar Orn Ragnarsson, Michael Sager, Patrick Johnson, Resock, Roses and Sabres, Sebastian Schaefer, Baba Evac, Shiggy, Nataziel, Grimm, James Varley, Nagar, and Avash5. You guys are awesome. Please leave a like if you're enjoying. Leave a comment. I do read them all. I do respond. I appreciate everybody spending some time with me today. I wonder if this Mornfang's going to eat my critters. <laughs> it just might. Anyway, I'll see you next time. We have to get construction going full steam ahead. It's going to be a major, major thing that needs to be done here. And no one's been doing it consistently or properly. Mm. Visitors with stuff to trade. Sedge, 